Hey guys, we're going to look at hardware theft and protection. Hardware theft and protection, so basically looking after your computers and your devices so that people don't steal them, okay, or get access and cause all kinds of havoc. So let's see what's the first obvious one. Well, the first obvious one is a good password. All right, that's the first one. So nobody gets into your system. Passwords and an automatic system lock. What is an automatic system lock, you ask? If you did, I don't know if you did, I'm just sounded good when I said it. An automatic system lock is when you do not have any activity on your computer for a certain period of time, like five minutes. So no mouse clicks, no mouse movements, no keyboard, nothing. The system then automatically locks itself. So it, it locks the computer so that in order to get back in, you have to then sign in again, okay, or enter in your password to get back into the system. So that's what an automatic system lock is. Very, very handy, especially if you get up and you walk away from your computer and you forget to lock it. It just means that someone can't come and take over your computer. Okay, so that's what passwords and automatic system locks are for. One of my favorites is a biometric access feature on a lot of keyboards these days. Not oh, sorry, keyboard laptops. On a lot of laptops these days, you see that there is a little uh, thumbprint scanner or a fingerprint scanner either on the trackpad or towards the bottom right of the keyboard depends on the make and model of the of the laptop sometimes on the side of the laptop as well and it will scan your fingerprint that you've registered and allow you access to your device so anyone who does not have your fingerprint which is everyone because they don't have your fingerprint unless they have your finger eh, that would be pretty painful then it means that they can't get access to your computer then we have the good old physical steel cable bolted down to the ground guys nobody gets away with it this time because this is a Kensington lock you've heard of Kensington locks I have oh, well I've always called them Kensington locks basically you just tie it tie a steel cable to your computer there's special little connection points connected to the computer tied to a table that's pretty big and heavy or a bar or something that they can't get it, get it off and um, there you go safe and sound mm -hmm. and then we also have which I would love to have one of these is a motion sensor okay so it uh, is connected to your computer it's, got, it's connected to like a, a trigger and you can actually see in the picture there there's a the little cable it looks like an antenna but that's actually a little point that plugs into something else and the moment your computer is moved and pulled away or picked up and that thing gets disconnected an alarm a very loud alarm I'll have you know triggers and then you know someone's trying to take your stuff and you can go get them yeah get your stuff back and of course last but not least the lockable cabinet guys if all else fails lock it in a safe or a lockable cabinet like this one and then you can see like I mean everything's locked up it's got wheels which is pretty cool uh, there you can see the screen you can't even like touch the screen you can't touch the screen you've got a the keyboard and mouse underneath it and like a drawer that comes out and then everything else there's a pr oh there's a printer in there as well I didn't see the printer there's a printer in there and then the desktop unit down at the bottom you can actually lock it all away nice and safe